for anglers coming from a northerly direction, Guildford Road is the most logical choice to get to Sandwich Beach. There's a heavy toll charge though, so to avoid this, take the long way round from Deal in the south along Gulf Road. Whilst we're doing that, I'll point out some marks you might hear about. Godwin Road is definitely in Deal, but people do refer to the Godwin Road end of the bay. A few hundred yards further up marks what starts to feel more like Sandwich now than Deal, with the remains of Sandown Castle as the landmark. Halfway up Gulf Road is the country pub called Checkers, a mark often mentioned in fishing reports. The most northerly mark in the bay with easy parking is the slipway that forms part of Sandwich Sailing Club, which is where we'll start. The slip end of the bay is much quieter and this is a really nice place to fish. Sandwich Bay is a very popular spot as it regularly produces big fish, bass and sole but especially rays and is snake free fishing on clean sand. On the way into the sailing club along Gulf Road, you'll pass checkers that we saw on the map earlier. Fishing here involves a walk across the golf course. A quick look at the depths in the bay. And then finally, as we come back to Deal, to fish the south of the bay, best place to park is by Sandown Castle. Free parking within yards of the beach. If you like to fish a certain set of conditions, then check out the Waveboy data for the Goodwind Sands. There's not one specifically for the inside of the bay, but the Goodwind Sands aren't far out. The Waveboy will tell you the sea temperature, wave height, and if the sea is building or falling. 